This is My Dad Story, a statistical investigation by Amy Everhard. The question I chose to investigate was, in year seven, do boys spend more time per week doing homework than girls? It is socially seen for girls to spend more time on study than boys. Therefore, I predict that year seven girls will spend more time doing homework than boys. It is important to note that for this investigation, time is measured to the nearest hour. I have source data used from the 2014 ABS Census at School website. I identified the questions I would use to gather my data as What year level are you in? What is your gender? and estimate how many hours a week you usually spend doing homework. I selected a random data set of 25 Year 7 girls and 25 Year 7 boys. This gave me a total sample size of 50 Year 7 students. After I got my sample data, I worked on different ways to visually represent what the data was showing. To do this, I use both Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Word. This table shows the original data sourced, with Year 7 girls on the left and Year 7 boys on the right. I use the Excel sorting tool to show the data in ascending order. Using the Excel Auto Sum tool, I then calculated the total for each gender. It came to 149 hours for girls and 101 hours for boys. Adding a total is useful to answer the investigation question. This table allows for easy identification of how many students were recorded per hour. For example, you can see 9 Year 7 boys said they spent one hour per week doing homework. The stem and leaf plot helps to summarise data and show any frequencies. It can be seen on my stem and leaf plots that many students only spend a small amount of time per week on homework. This dot plot helps to highlight clusters, gaps and outliers. However, I don't believe data is correctly shown on this graph, therefore it is not useful for this investigation. These sector graphs make it hard to compare data due to the large amount. Data could have been condensed, however this representation is not useful for this investigation. This double column graph easily allows data to be compared. However, by creating a single column graph to show the total number of hours makes it easier to look for an answer to the investigation question. This summary statistics table shows the central tendency of data which was calculated using Excel formula tools. The mean represents the average of initial data. The median shows the middle value. The mode shows the most frequently occurring data and the range shows the difference between the highest and lowest values. The difference row helps to identify that on average Year 7 girls spend two more hours on homework. So what conclusion can be drawn from my data investigation? My prediction was correct. Year 7 girls do spend more time per week doing homework than Year 7 boys. However, caution must be taken with data results. Data was taken from a small sample size and therefore cannot represent all Year 7 girls and boys. I cleaned data to remove errors, however this can cause inaccuracies. Also, the answers recorded were estimates and may not be a true reflection of time spent. Thank you for watching. Please note this video is for educational uses only. Created using Powtoon.